In the years that I've been living, a lot of things have surely changed. A lot of things have come and gone, some even came back again. But through all the many changes, some things are for sure. And you know that my feeling kind of makes me feel secure because I would face baseball hot dogs at the it's no surprise that some 100 million Americans will watch the Super Bowl. That's 40 million more than go to church on Christmas. It's also 85 million more than watch the last game of the World Series. And in that is an economic lesson for America. Because football is built on an economic model of fairness and opportunity. And baseball is built on a model where the rich always win and the poor usually have no chance. Or to put it another way, football is more like the democratic philosophy. Baseball, on the other hand, is exactly like the Republicans. And I don't just mean it's incredibly boring. <laughs> I mean their economic theory is every man for himself. Democrats don't want to eliminate capitalism or competition, but they would like it if some kids didn't have to go to a crummy school in a rotten neighborhood, while others get to go to a great school, and their dad gets them into Harvard. Because when that happens, achieving the American dream is easy for some and just a fantasy for others. Because if you're not in the game, you become indifferent to the fate of the game and may, maybe even get bitter. That's what's happening to the middle class in America. Or to put it another way, football is more like the democratic philosophy. Because they don't want anyone to fall too far behind. Baseball, on the other hand, is exactly like the Republicans.